Hey, what is going on, everyone? Big here for Serpent X Tech. And I just got a quick call out for everybody uh, to just monitor their pool uh, because the hash rate that you're getting locally at the miner may not reflect the pool level and you're missing out on some profits. Here we're looking at my K0 Ultra, which is reporting around 600 giga hash because it's overclocked with the PB Farmer firmware. And if we verify a pool, we're sure enough getting that same hash rate, which is good. However, Lithium, Alpheum, however you want to say it, it's a bit of a different story. Looking at Humpool, we're only averaging around 300 giga hash, and the system hasn't restarted that much. But locally, we're getting a consistent, even though it's way overclocked, higher than I would recommend leaving it at. Um, it's still getting close to 560 to 580 giga hash, somewhere in that range. But it's not reporting. And look, there's a new firmware update from PB Farmer. Awesome. Uh, but it's not reporting at the the pool. Now, maybe the firmware update will fix that. But just know, like, you should always check at the pool level because something isn't right. Even though locally we can see the pool rejection rates at 0%. Like, we're getting no rejections at the miner. So it's probably something that's not being read correctly and the pool's not counting it. And so we're missing out on shares. And so if we look at this chart, we're only averaging around 300 giga hash when the stock is 400 giga hash at the pool when we're getting close to 600 giga hash locally. So always check the pool and double check and verify. We could try switching to a different pool to see if the uh, issue persists. If we continue to still see less than 400 giga hash, even though we're almost at 600 right now, uh, that would be the best test that I would uh, do. But I'm going to do a firmware update and then bring you guys back once we confirm that information and now after the firmware update you can see the pool is reporting the correct hash rate so the previous one i think it's 0 0.82 uh the hash rate was below 300 around 300 giga hash right but now that the firmware update uh that we're on i'll link it down in the description to the latest uh, pb farmer repo but now we're, we're 580 got a peak here of 661 giga hash 569 558 and we're climbing back up so around 575 to 550 giga hash is where my overclock is sitting and we're getting that locally at the miner but now it is correctly showing at the pool now it doesn't have the 24 hour rate hash rate um updated yet that's because we haven't gotten a full 24 hours on it but you can clearly see the difference in the graph from before where our overclocks while it was showing the correct hash rate at the miner locally wasn't getting detected or correctly detected at the pool and after the recent firmware update it definitely improved the hash rate so make sure you update to the latest and greatest from pv farmer and a huge thanks to them for uh continuously providing updates on these type of devices so we'll see what's coming next but that's going to do it for today's video hit that like button the way out make sure to get subscribed hit notification bell to stay up to date and check out additional links in the description to help support the channel and what we do here and you just have yourself a wonderful day take care I'll catch you in the next one.